If you're looking to buy cigarettes, you will not find them at CVS. That's right. The company is making a landmark decision today to stop selling tobacco products. KX HD News reporter Tashara Parker joins us in the studio with the latest. And Tashara, it sounds like this decision could be a game changer for other major corporations as well. Luke, Amanda, that's right. Today, CVS changed the game when they ended sales of tobacco a month ahead of their target date. The company announced in February that it planned to drop all tobacco products because tobacco sales conflicted with its mission. We spoke with one local tobacco prevention organization, and they tell us why they believe the decision will make waves across the drugstore community. Good reason was my girls. One Good Reason, that's the name of CVS Pharmacy's new social media campaign. The genesis for this was after our news in February that we were quitting tobacco, we were struck by how many people had stories. The second largest drugstore chain behind Walgreens announced today that they will no longer sell tobacco products. It's a landmark decision that local tobacco prevention organizations say could change the game when it comes to tobacco sales. Hopefully the other couple corporations will understand the importance and the significance of what CVS has done. Burton says one of the main goals of the Brazos Valley Council on Alcohol and Substance Abuse, or BB CASA, is to reduce usage, but specifically to get tobacco out of the hands of young adults. By CVS limiting access, that is essentially helping us to reduce, ultimately, hopefully, um, usage. CVS Corporate even changed its name along with the big announcement. Instead of going by CVS Caremark, the company announced today that its new name is CVS Health. It really reflects our purpose as a company, helping people on their path to better health. And a health decision that BB Casa says is a major step in the right direction, and one that they hope will reduce the nearly half a million Americans who die every year due to tobacco use. The more we can do as far as reduction in availability will hope, hope, hopefully ultimately lead to, you know, some of those numbers going down. For more information on BB Casa or ways to get involved with tobacco prevention efforts, head over to our website, kixtv.com. The organization will also host adult tobacco coalition meetings every first Thursday of the month at 3.30 p.m. Coming up tonight at 10, we'll show you how more than 30 youngsters are joining the fight against tobacco in their schools.